Hiya. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lavish V here and a big thank you to each and every one of my subscribers. You are awesome, awesome, awesome. For those of you who are new to my channel, what I do here, it is some hair, fashion, makeup, beauty, vlogging, and a lot of perfume reviews. Yes, if you haven't already subscribed, come on, you know what to do. Please hit the subscription button along with the notification bell. Please watch my videos and do leave me some thumbs up. And guys, girls, women, men, please don't forget to comment in my comment section as I am so enjoying the interaction with all of you guys. So yes, please do keep your comments coming. So guys, without further ado, let's jump right into today's perfume review. And the one I've got for you today, it is the Kenzo World. And yes, this one, as I would call this, um, this is the box, y'all. Let's, let's discuss the box a little bit. So the box, it is in, what, 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 what color is this now? I would say it's like a pastel green, but in the eye right here, it's like a, it's like a shiny teal. So it's a little bit different and then the Kenzo World is in gold. But I'm going to bring it close and you decide what color it is for yourself, y'all. So as you can see what I've said, it's a pastel green and then the eye with the tealy, um, glossy green and the gold for the Kenzo writing. So it's their official look and it's like... I see you okay so that's what this I represent yeah so what I'm gonna do is get rid of the box y'all because what in in all together I just wanted to show you what it came like and then when you open the box that's the fragrance down inside and as you can see it comes with a black cap and this is oh wait it comes with a black cap so it's hidden inside so let's get rid of the box and then we go for the bottle now I've recently just added this to my collection y'all I've tested it used it and everything just to come and do the review and I've worn it again another time when I was popping out and I was quite like okay I need to review this now so that it's out there so anyways as you can see it's the same as the kenzo world the style it's the shape of the eye and then this one it's movable interesting again um and um the cap is black and it's got that pastel -y, greeny tealy look in the middle here so it, it's 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 not a bad looking thing but i don't particularly like the plastic that they put on this it they could have made it metal and a bit shiny or, or whatever but oh we're not we, we, i like to look at the bottles as well so uh this one it's not really shouting like display me it's more like mm, okay enough about me and the bottle yeah let's move on to what it smells like so i'm gonna put the notes on the screen just right here and while you're looking at your notes i'm gonna get a test strip and i'm also gonna spray the atmosphere for this one. Oh, i forget to say look at the top when you take the cap off so yeah and this kenzo world it was um it's a, a while around it's um 2016 i believe and um yeah so you've got a good look at the the bottle now so let us um spray my test strip like i've said and spray the atmosphere for you to see what it sprays like oh i'm gonna say that before i even go further i love the scent it's very fruity and it's popping some berries and it smells nice this this is a very fruity ambery floral fragrance y'all and that's what it's popping it's very floral like i've said and i think floral of peony mm. 
Peony and Jasmine. So, like I've said, this is a very fruity amber from floral amber for me. It's very amberly. A little bit sweet, not overly sweet. And it's nice. I like it. I'm not going to complain. It has a freshness to it. It smells clean. It smells nice. And I'll be enjoying it during the hot days, y'all. It has um, a sort of rosy smell to it. Um, and a little bit musky and it has like a unique kind of smell it's it smells different I could it could even be a signature scent because it smells different and I'm trying to put my hands on there. Not hands. I'm trying to put my head around what exactly it smells like. There's a scent to it that um, reminds me of something. But I can't really put my hands on there. But it, it is a nice smell. I like it a lot. But... And it's different to the Kenzo World Power. Different to the Kenzo World Power. This is the Kenzo World, y'all. So, I'm going to try to sum this one up. And I'm going to say that this is a sweet, um, fruity, ambery floral. And a little bit musky, a little bit woody rose. And... It's fresh. It's got some cleanness to it. And it's perfect for the summer. Spring, summer. And I would say that the longevity on this, it is five to seven hours for me when I've used it. And the silage is, I would say the silage is moderate, moderate silage. But I'm, when I keep smelling it, it's like I'm trying to break what I'm feeling for it. Like, what is it similar to? But I'm not... I'm not catching it. I'm smelling, 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 but I'm not catching it. It smell. It's got some uniqueness to it, nevertheless, and I like it. And it's good for the warm weather, like I've said. So it's perfect for spring and definitely great for the summer. And it is nice, and I have no complaint. I'll be using it a lot, and you'll be seeing this um, around uh, um, in some other videos, y'all. Because as I'm using it, I'm gonna tell you more and more and more about it so that's it for the kenzo world guys before i go please if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and do so give me some thumbs up and do do leave some comments in the comment section and also please check out my playlist i have over 300 videos there of perfumes y'all so please do check out my playlist and it's been fun talking to you and reviewing this bottle kenzo world so look after yourself until next time bye Mm, so good.